Right, hello, I'm Matty. Welcome to my video. Um, here I am, painting in the freezing cold in Stromovka Park, on Stromovka Park, in Prague. Okay, this is the first time I've gone and dared to paint outside in below zero temperatures. This is done over nine days for various reasons. It took me nine days to complete this. First of all, it was freezing cold. I was literally stabbing for the best part, the painting with my, with my brush, trying to push paint into the right place. And I just didn't have the means, the dexterity to actually accurately place the paint on the canvas because of the freezing cold temperature. Uh, as you saw at the start, I am all bundled up. That is accurate. It is accurate, all but the gloves, actually. The gloves, I, I had myself like with, if you saw with three gloves. I did try that. It was impossible to paint with three gloves. But um, yeah, most part, I just have like one pair, sometimes two pairs of gloves as I'm painting here. All right, so yeah. Um, finally, now I'm reaching, what, day three here. You can see there's been, there's a bit of an evolution, really, in my painting. Uh, as like snow melts, snow falls, s snow comes and goes. Um, uh, these photographs are taken by my girlfriend, Zdeni. Thank you, Zdeni. Uh, yeah, here we go, this is day four, day four. I thought day four was gonna be my last day. If you can see the paints, the paint, the, the snow started to melt. Um, and I really liked it, you know, had a nice definition on the ground, you know, you can see underneath the benches there, like, there's no, where, where there is no snow, around that little tree, there's no snow. So you can see little, you know, dark and white shapes in the, in the landscape. However, come day five, the snow had just bucketed down the day before. So I started to throw snow all over that bench, as there was snow covered on that bench. And also the tree, you can see the tree to the left, I had to start putting snow onto the tree leaves. Which I'd painstakingly tried to get the leaves in the right place and suddenly I was now throwing white snow all over it all. And the landscape would continue to change by the next video. Next video, next day even. Okay, yeah, it's minus seven degrees, yep. And I started to put the actual temperature, uh, showed it on my, uh, my phone as I wanted to actually show you how freezing cold it really was. So yeah, I, the, the sky, the sky had these nice blues in the sky, but I you know what, you know, that sky was the same color as the landscape. So there I was throwing the white into the sky. Minus five, a bit warmer, just a bit. Anyway, now, because it's been below zero for so long, the, the lake had frozen over. So there I am, what was once a really dark lake, I'm now making as white as, as the land around. So, and you can see people actually on the, on the lake. And for someone like me, that is like so unusual. So finally, I started painting people into the painting. Like, I, I think I, people actually literally stepping, standing on the lake. Okay, day eight. Minus seven, good times, yep. And again, more people are coming, more people are on the lake. Um, less snowfall, so once again, I'm mucking around with the trees. I spent most of the time mucking around with those trees. There was snow on, there was snow off. In the end, I just took all the snow off. I quite like the shapes of the trees as they were. But, um, but, but I, I really wanted to make the focus, the actual, the actual lake itself. And now we're up to the final day, day nine. It was down to minus nine. And look at it, like it was just completely packed. The, the la I, I, I was not even expecting this. I came, I came, I came to my little spot where, which I've been painting on for nine days and suddenly there were all these people everywhere. Yeah, there is a pandemic on by the way, but hey, we're not exactly the best down in Prague for, for social distancing. But anyway, I mean, it was, Mind that it was phenomenal seeing all these people on the on the ice, and there was like hockey players. If you can see in the final painting on the on the uh, right, we've got some hockey players. On the left, you've got some children. In the middle, you see this woman skating. I yeah, I mean, it was phenomenal seeing that. 
And I mean, oh yeah, down below as well, like a little kind of more somber note. I painted the soul individual. I mean, I, I do have a girlfriend, but for the best part of this time during quarantine, I live alone and I couldn't help but reflect to this kind of, this kind of loneliness that myself and I'm sure a lot of us are experiencing right now. And I don't know, I, don't know, I throw a bit of personality in here and I don't know, I, I thought there was something symbolic about having a soul individual sitting on the bench whilst everybody's, you know, doing their thing. Hey, well, thank you very much for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it.